One of our columnists wrote earlier, this is a bailout that nationalises losses and privatises gains. Weren't banking rules meant to stop this? I totally disagree with that statement. It's not a bailout. Uh, and everything was done by the rules, and it's a national liquidation of two banks declared failing or likely to fail by DCB. Would you, would you not say, though, that those who claim that this unwind, we'll call it, undermines confidence in the banking union project? I don't think so. As I said, we negotiated the rules with the European institutions, the SSM, the SRB, DG Competition. DG Competition has stated yesterday that uh, state aid is totally legal in this case, so there is no disruption of the rules whatsoever. OK, it's legal, but a week or two ago, Spain's popular went down a different route. It was wound down without state aid. How are these two Italian lenders different from Banco Popular? Well, I think that the differences between Banco Popular, not Banco Popular and the Veneta banks, but between Santander and the Italian bank that decided to come in and acquire uh, the good assets of the uh, banks subject to, to liquidation, uh, but with the clause that the, the capital ratio of Intesa San Paolo, the acquiring bank, would be kept unchanged by the operation. So while on the other hand, Banco Santander uh, had to uh, raise as much as 7 billion euros to raise capital to uh, leave the ratios unchanged. So you don't accept the accusation that some have leveled today that this unwind, whatever you want to call it, leads to a non-level playing field in Europe? Absolutely not. The, this is capital neutral, so the position of the Banca Intesa has not changed from that point of view. And as I said, given the fact that this is a liquidation according to some specific rules, it was deemed to be totally legal from the point of view of, of state aid rules. So this is not ch exactly because it's not changing the, the level play, the, le the playing field that we had that, uh, we, we had that assessment by DG competition.